Before we will start don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel thank you. The T-129 attack helicopter for Philippine Air Force. We will talk about its features and specifications today. T-129 attack helicopter main roles. 1. Attack. Number 2. Armed reconnaissance. 3. Armed escort and number 4 is precision strike. At number 5 is deep strike at number 6 fire support, 7 suppress enemies air defense, at number 8 security or urban warfare. And now we will talk about its features. 1. Design features. At number 2 performance 3 is weapons. At number 4 integrated missions and its avionics, number 5 survivability and last supportability. The technical data of the attack helicopter are as follows, length of the attack helicopter is 13.45 meters 44.30 feet. Main rotor diameter 11.9 meters or 39 feet. The width is 3.49 meters 11.45 feet. Engine 2 LHTECCTS 804A turboshaft 1014 kW 1360 horsepower each. The fuel tank is 762 kg. Main design gross weight 5000 kg or 11,023 pounds. Its performance. Maximum speed 278 km per hour 173 miles per hour 150 knots Cruise speed is 269 km per hour 167 miles per hour 144 knots Its range 561 km or 349 miles 303 nautical miles. The ferry range of the attack is 1000 km or 620 miles, 540 nautical miles. Service ceiling 6096 meters or 20,000 feet, and the last is rate of climb 14 meters per second 2800 feet min. The weapon of the attack helicopter are as follows. Asymmetric loading capability. Weapons automatically recognized and managed via MFD. For Station 1 and 4. For anti-tank missiles. For guided rockets 2.75 inch. 19 unguided rockets 2.75 inch. Air-to-air -air missiles. Gun pod 12.7 mm or 250 pounds. Station number 2 and number 3. For guided rockets 2.75 inch. 19 unguided rockets 2.75 inch. 2 air-to-air -air missiles. Its gun. 1 by M197 20 by 102 mm or 0.787 inches 3 barrel rotary cannon 500 rad. The attack T-129 weapon ranges in kilometers. One guns 20 millimeters its range up to 2 kilometers. Two 2.75 inch guided rockets 8 kilometers. At number three anti-tank missiles 8 kilometers and the last air-to-air -air missiles ranging up to 5 kilometers. Now we will talk about its cockpits, T-129 attack have two cockpits. One, forward cockpit or gunner roll and number two is rear cockpit or the pilot roll, they have the same functions either way. One, target acquisition. Number two, target selection and engagement. Number three, management of weapons systems. Four, aircraft handling. 5. Navigation and 6. Communications. Target acquisition of T-129 attack helicopter. 
Attack T-129 used multiple target tracking devices such as Thermal TV and Spotter. It uses also helmet-mounted queuing system AVCI. It features 1. Night Vision Modules Number 2. FLIR 3. Symbology It uses observation and targeting sight unit OTS. It features 1. High resolution FLIR Number 2. Color TV camera 3. Laser finder, designator 4. Color spotter camera and 5. Laser spot tracker Survivability of the attack 129 It has two components 1. Undetected features Low visual signature Low acoustic signature Low IR signature Low radar signature Number 2 component Missile warning system IR including suppressor Flares Jammer Radar warning receiver Jammer Laser warning receiver the specification of T-129 attack helicopter Main role attack helicopter National origin Italy and Turkey Manufacturer Turkish Aerospace Industries, Thai Augusta Westland, Leonardo from 2017 First flight on 28 September 2009 It was introduced 2014 Status in service Primary user Turkish Army Produced 2009 present Number build 59 units The program cost 3.2 billion United States dollars Developed from Augusta A129 Mangusta There are only two variants for T129 attack helicopter 1. T-129 EDH or T-129A attack or early delivery helicopter also known as the combat support. The other variance is much bigger the T-129V is the multi-role version equipped with the leading edge electronics warfare systems. As of now only three countries who operate and ongoing to acquire T-129 attack helicopter. 1. Turkish Army the developer. Number 2. The Pakistan Army Aviations Corporations. And number 3. The Philippine Air Force. next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.